really want to optimize outcomes for patients. And I don't think anyone's satisfied with the status quo because we have people who fly in to Vail, Aspen, Frisco, Dillon, Basalt, because they expect us to be on the cutting edge of the evidence and not just copying what everyone else is doing, but pushing the envelope and creating the science and then other people can copy us. <laughs> So during the summit, I'll be talking about the regulatory landscape in regenerative medicine, um, which is really critical for us uh, as clinicians to understand. My first slide is the ocean because it's a moving target sometimes, but we're trying to do everything we can to you know, stay within the confines of the legal boundaries, and we have to be aware of those, but also balance that with pushing the science as far as we can to help patients, and that's a very delicate balance. What excites me the most about the summit is the groundbreaking basic science research that's being translated into clinical application. And that's really, really, really important because if you don't have that foundation, you, know, you don't necessarily know how it's gonna affect patients. Uh, my colleagues, uh, I look around and I'm inspired to be around them every single day. Uh, we all push each other to be better. Uh, everyone cares so deeply about the patients and that seems to be the driving force. I'm conscious of that. I'm conscious that I'm around Hall of Famers every day. 